Alright, welcome back to Terraria. In today's video is I'm going to be teaching you guys how to mine any of the hard mode ores right when you guys get right into the hard mode. Uh, hard mode. Before you guys get into hard mode, you guys are actually going to need to get uh, Hellstone. And Hellstone is going to also play a big part in getting the hard mode ores, such as all this. So this is Hellstone right here. And these, I have them set side by side because whatever world you have and whatever ore your world gets, it's they're randomized. So uh, Cobalt is the same as Palladium, Mithril is the same as Orcalcium, and Adamantite is the same as titanium now this is also this one's completely different uh, we'll get into this one a bit later i have a lot of pickaxes inside my inventory as you guys can see we have the nightmare pickaxe we have the death bringer pickaxe we have the molten pickaxe the cobalt pickaxe the plidium pickaxe the orcalcium pickaxe the mithril pickaxe the adamantite pickaxe the titanium pickaxe and we also have the drax we also have the chlorophyte pickaxe and uh, the chlorophyte drill there's also a pickaxe version of the drax and it's uh, got the same crafting recipe i'm positive we have all these pickaxes here and they are going to play a big thing in these um in this so to mine hellstone you are going to need to either get the nightmare pickaxe or the uh, deathbringer pickaxe now the thing about it is is this one is corruption and this one is crimson now depending on which one you guys have it would be de um it, it's also whatever you choose if you're on pc so if you choose crimson then that means you guys have the deathbringer pickaxe if you guys choose the corruption that means you guys have the nightmare pickaxe now i'm pretty sure on console you can't really choose your uh, thing so whatever it is and then you'll go with either one of these they both work the same this is what you would use to go ahead and uh, mine some hellstone and then this is and the hellstone bars you also need obsidian too uh you can use uh your death raider pickaxe or your shadow pickaxe to mine obsidian as well they're both the same they both got the same pickaxe power and the pickaxe power between both of them the pickaxe power is 70 pickaxe power this one's also got 65 pickaxe power so this one's a little bit better because of what the perks it's got now they both are the same and when you guys get enough hellstone bars you guys can make the molten pickaxe now the molten pickaxe i'm pretty positive can only mine these two glorious uh hard mode ores right here so what you guys want to gonna do is go ahead make your uh, make your molten pickaxe straight out of uh, 20 health hellstone bars which is it's pretty expensive it, so to make the again the molten 20 hellstone bars once you make the uh, the molten pickaxe you guys can mine cobalt ore or you can mine palladium ore they're both the same they both got the same perks. You guys can, uh, it's whatever your world has. They are very, it's very random when you uh, smash the demon altars. But the Molten Pickaxe has 100 pickaxe power. And that's why you can go ahead and mine the Cobalt and Palladium. Next, when you have that, you guys can either make the Cobalt or Palladium Pickaxe. Either one of them. I'm going to go ahead. And, so the Cobalt and Palladium Pickaxe, okay, so 15 Cobalt bars and the Palladium Pickaxe is 18 Plidium bars. Now, Plidium and Cobalt are pretty common in the world, so what you're going to do is either watch whichever one you have, they both are the same pickaxe. 130 pickaxe power this one has, and this one has 110. Again, they may vary from the perks that they have. This one is a Cobalt pickaxe. This one's a Plidium pickaxe. Now, depending uh, on what ore you have, they both work the same. Cobalt is a little bit different, but you guys can mine uh, Mithril ore with the Cobalt pickaxe. And you can uh, mine Orcalcium ore with uh, the Plidium one. You can mine Orcalcium or Mithril with either one of them. It doesn't matter which one you have. So whatever world he has, and whatever one you have, it's either Orcalcium or Mithril. And it's either one you have of these two. It's either Plidium or Cobalt. Whatever one you have, it's randomized. Once you guys have all that, you guys can go ahead and make either an Orcalcium or a Mithril pickaxe, whichever one your world has again. Orcalcium, 18 bars of Orcalcium. I'm pretty sure I'm saying that right. 15 bars of Mithril. Now, whatever one you have, it doesn't really matter which one you have. Again, they both work the same. You guys can go ahead and mind... Um, some adamantite or you guys can mine some mithril and it's pretty pretty cool on how you can mine all these ores with these pickaxes it is a very simple process it's not very hard um now the adamantite and the titanium uh i'm pretty positive cannot mine this you cannot mine this with uh, adamantite or titanium they just have a strong perk so they're 180 pickaxe power, which is not enough for all this. And the titanium is 190, uh, which has very uh, fast speeds. This one has fast speeds as well. Um, 18 adamantite bars and titanium bars for um, 
20 titanium bars for the titanium pickaxe. Now, once you guys have all uh, got, gotten all your uh, all your hard mode ores, all pro probably I'm recommending all the way up until you have a lot of adamantite or titanium, whichever one your world has. I recommend to get these, make enough, make enough armor with them, enough weapons, and, and get all the stuff you need because you guys are going to need to fight the mechanical bosses. Uh, this is a completely different uh, tutorial, so I'm not going to talk about much about the mechanical bosses. But once you guys defeat all the mechanical bosses, you guys will get Soul of Fright, Soul of Might. And soul of sight and you'll get hollowed bars by them now i'm pretty sure you get enough to make either the drax or the hollowed pickaxe now what you can do with the drax is um actually once you uh, defeated uh plantera uh this will start to grow inside the jungle and this is how you mine chlorophyte you need the drax so basically all you you need to fight all three of the mechanical bosses so you'll have enough for hollow uh hopefully you'll have enough for hollowed armor and you'll have uh enough for the drax pickaxe and maybe the excalibur but this is how you mine the chlorophyte right here you get the drax you need to f defeat all the, uh, all three of the mechanical bosses which is the twins the destroyer and skeletron prime you'll get all these souls this one drops from i think this one drops from skeletron prime this one drops from the destroyer and this one drops from the twins and then you'll get that and you'll go ahead and be able to mine chlorophyte after you defeat plantera and uh that's a pretty much it um i hope this was a very good tutorial for you guys i hope it wasn't too confusing i can go on a recap so you do need the nightmare uh, not to shut up uh you need shadow scales and 12 demonite bars to make the uh, nightmare pickaxe you need 12 crimson night bars and uh some uh tissue samples for the deathbringer pickaxe and uh yeah so you can mine hellstone with that and after you get all that you can uh you can get the molten pickaxe to mine either plutium or cobalt, whichever one your world has, and then you can make either the plutium or the cobalt pickaxe, whichever again, whichever one your world had, to mine mithril or or calcium, and so on and so forth. Same thing with these. The reason why they're both next to each other is because your world will vary between which one you your world will actually have. Uh, with that said, uh, you really do need to def uh, defeat Plantera and all three mechanical bosses for uh, Chlorophyte, but Chlorophyte is the strongest out of all of them besides the Moon Lord. Once you get towards the Moon Lord, you will get uh, a lot more stronger things other than Chlorophyte, but Chlorophyte's going to be your best friend all the way up until then. I hope this was a very good tutorial for you guys. If you guys, uh, if it was a very good tutorial and you did follow it really good and it worked out for you guys and now you guys know how to mind all the hard mode or uh yeah so smack um leave it a thumbs up if it worked out for you guys i hope it was very helpful for you guys leave it uh let me know down in the comments below if it was and leave it a like and as always i'll see you guys in the next video peace